What's up, ballers? Welcome back to another Flashback Friday video. Today we're doing 92-93 Skybox Series 2. Uh, there was a comment from someone in the last video um, that they like this set, so I'm going to go ahead and open this up today. Um, again, looking for Shaq rookies. In our last Flashback Friday, we did Fleer Ultra, and unfortunately those cards were all sticking together, so we didn't make it through the whole box in the video. I opened the rest off camera, so here's one of the Jordans I pulled and one of the Shaq rookies, I pulled three, and this was the one that was in the best condition, so that's in the card saver, ready to go to PSA, uh, Instagram, Big J Basketball. Go give that a follow if you haven't yet. And I have more uh, old school vintage stuff here that I'll be ripping soon. So again, same thing, I got Fleer, Tops, Tops Archives, Hoops, Upper Deck 92, 93, and Upper Deck 91, 92 and the Stadium Club that I'm really excited about. I'll probably wait to do the Stadium Club because that'll be one of the better ones. But if there's anything that you guys really want to see uh, broken out of all this stuff for the next Flashback Friday, just let me know in the comments and we'll, uh, we'll do that one next. So again, we've got another big box here. This is 36 packs, 12 cards per pack, and 137 card set. So we're probably going to get a lot of doubles. Um, I think this Shaq may have been short printed in this, if I'm not mistaken. So I don't know how many Shaq cards we're going to get. Um, hopefully we at least get a couple. And hopefully at least one of those is in grade worthy conditions. So far, all the Shaq rookies I'm pulling, I've gotten at least one out of each 92-93 box that's uh, grade worthy. So the 92-93 upper deck I pulled not too long ago. Um, that one's already at PSA or on its way to be uh, to be graded, getting shipped to PSA now. So probably be a while before I get that one back, um, but I'm hoping for at least a nine on that one. All right, so all right, no sticking, nice and silky smooth. Here's Magic Johnson. Skybox always like to use their full names, Irvin Johnson, not Magic. Same thing with like Spud Webb and other guys who had nicknames. Um, they always seem to use the full name instead of the nickname. Mo uh, Mookie, that's got his nickname on there. There's a Harold Miner Baby Jordan rookie. <laughs> Oliver Miller, that is a rookie as well. They have a, like a rookie tag here on all the rookies and a checklist. So let's put our rookies in one stack. All right, one pack down, 35 more to go. So it's gonna be another long video, guys. Uh, there should be some inserts in here. Uh, back in 92, 93, again, inserts weren't that common, uh, but around this time they started having more inserts. Uh, again, not Pooh Richardson, Jerome Richardson. Skybox with their uh, Full names. Malik Seeley, that's a rookie. And Tracy Murray, rookie. Anthony Avent, rookie. And these cards look like they're in pretty good shape so far. So I think if we do hit a Shaq, we might get lucky uh, and have one that's in really good condition. I, so far, none of these cards look like they're really uh, banged up or anything like that. So... Dale Ellis, three-point specialist, Dale Ellis. See again, Glenn Rivers instead of Doc Rivers. Here's rookies of Lloyd Daniels, Dave Johnson, and Chris Smith. So looks like about two to three rookies uh, per pack so far. Um, but again, I'm, sh I'm pretty sure that Shaq is short printed if I'm not mistaken. Uh-oh, I've already seen doubles already. More Irvin Johnson, David Wood. Danny Ainge. There's a Robert Ori rookie, big shot Rob. So this has all the rookies and Latrell Sprewell. Hey, there's James Worthy, Michael Jordan, and Sam Perkins. This is a school ties insert card all guys who went to the same school so this is all unc guys so there's jordan number one i don't know if we're gonna hit a base jordan here i think the base jordans uh might only be in series one and not series two so i don't know what our chances are of hitting one of those uh base jordans probably not too good 
X-Man, Sam Mitchell, Vinny Del Negro, Steve Kerr. What do we got here? They threw in some weird cards back in the day. Special Olympics. Dan Marley on the cover. Barkley is in Series 2 because he was traded to Phoenix that year from Philly. Clarence Weatherspoon, Randy Woods, another checklist. I'll put, put Chuck in the hit stack, even though that's Barkley base card is not really a hit. The man that I opened a lot of this stuff 27 and 28 years ago. Ainge, Charles Smith. Yeah, we're going to get a lot of doubles. Alfonso Ellis and Byron Houston. Another one of these school ties cards. I bet if you get all those school ties cards and line them up in order, they probably all connect. But I'm not super interested in trying to put that together. Head coach Scotty Brooks. Another Sam Mitchell, another Van Nago, another Steve Kerr, <laughs> another Special Olympics. Yeah, we are going to get, oh man, there's going to be lots and lots of doubles here. So rookies, three rookies, none of the ones we want. Uh, so, okay, so now that we know the rookies are on the back, I think I'm just going to kind of skip right to the back of all these packs and see what rookies we get. Yeah, so look at all these. More base cards, another Ori, Elmore Spencer, another checklist. I've gotten like three checklist cards already. So we're going to keep on chugging along here. Yeah, I don't think we're going to... Oh, here's a... There's a nice insert card, Sean Kemp. Is this the Thunder and Lightning with Kemp and Peyton? Yeah, look at that. Really cool insert card. This thing was a big hit back in the day. I don't know how much they're worth now, but nice hollow finish with Kemp on the front and Peyton on the back. Definitely a condition sensitive card with the black border. I can definitely see a lot of white around the edges and the corners. So definitely not something worth grading, but I would have been super excited to pull this one uh, back in the day. All right, there's Alonzo Mourning for the PC. It's nice to pick up all the uh, Alonzo Mourning rookies I used to have and now no longer have. And I know I can buy all those pretty much for a dollar if I wanted to, but it's kind of fun to pull them out of packs. Bryant Stith, Don McLean, and Latrell Sprewell. This is an insert card, I think. Yeah, insert draft picks card. So again, it'd be nice to pull a shack out of one of those inserts. But again, a lot of this stuff really isn't worth all that much unless you can find one that's in perfect condition to send to PSA. The raw ones, there's just so many out there that um, they're not really valuable just by themselves as a raw card. So we got to hope we can find that gem mint, that gem mint shack. So let's keep going. No shacks yet. Okay, let's go through all the base. Sean Rooks. There we go. Shack number one. A David Robinson card. How we looking, Shaq? How we looking? Huh? I like it so far. Yeah. Really good shape. Really, really, really good shape. At least on first inspection. All right, Shaq number one down. Let's go. Let's get some more Shaqs. I mean, if they look to me like they'll get at least a PSA 9, I'm definitely going to send them in. If I see something that looks pretty banged up, like it might get an 8 or less, I probably won't waste my time sending it in. 
Um, but that one looked good. I, I don't see any reason why that one wouldn't get uh, at least a nine. Here's a Series 2 checklist with the rookies on it. So I think that might be all the rookies in the set. So there's not a ton of rookies. So as long as that check isn't super short printed, we might get at least one or two more. And again, if I get more of that look, that look as good as that one did, I'll be very excited. I think I'm going to get like six, <laughs> well, at least of every other card. Sean Rooks, Brewell, another one of these weird David Robinson cards. Yeah, <clears throat> I think um, it won't be difficult to put together like three sets of base cards with there not being, like how many magics have we gotten so far? That's like the fifth one. Adam Keefe and Anthony Peeler. Another one of these school ties cards. So we got a big stack of rookies, mostly worthless. The Lonzo Morning is really only worth anything to me. And really that Shaq card is the only one of value so far, but we'll keep going. See if we can get another Shaq. Leitner, so would have been a decent card to pull 25 years ago. Oliver Miller, another David Robinson. Harold Miner, Elmore Spencer, and more checklist cards. Still got a decent amount of packs to go through. Try and keep this video to 20 minutes if I can help it. I know there's 36 packs. There's a lot to get through. Rookies in this pack, Hubert Davis and Walt Williams. It's another one of these draft pick insert cards, Elmore Spencer. So not sure what the odds are on those, but so far we've hit two. Just uh, the Spreewell and the Elmore Spencer. Nothing in that pack. Oh, I think I saw another one of those draft pick cards on the back, and I think it said bullets, so it's probably going to be Tom Gugliotta. But let's see. Clarence Weatherspoon, Tracy Murray, and Googs. There he is. I actually pulled a Tom Gugliotta autograph not too long ago from what that... Uh, Blowout Cards uh, holiday pack party that had a bunch of different packs from a bunch of different years. I think it might have been a Panini past, past, present, and future, or past and present. I forget what those cards were called, but I'm pretty sure I pulled a Gugliotta Auto out of one of those. Weatherspoon, there's Shaquille O'Neal, Corey Williams. All right, how's this Shaq looking? I like it so far. I like it so far. All right, Shaq number two. Might be sending both of those into PSA. I'm sure we'll see, man, magic. Is just everywhere in this box. If those were worth something, I would be retiring tomorrow, probably. Hey, another morning, I'll take it. All right, so so far it doesn't look like any of the rookies are short printed. Um, we've gotten two shacks and two mornings. I don't think we've really pulled that much more than any one specific rookie at this point. Ori, Isaiah Morris, All right, getting closer to the end here. It's 
It's pre -ball. There's another draft pick card of Walt Williams. So we hit four of those. Unfortunately, did not hit the shack. Maybe that card is short printed. It might be tough to hit that shack insert card. I'd like that another thunder and lightning card too. Those are really cool looking. Malik Sealy, Randy Woods. That is a big stack of base cards for only a, a 137 card set. Todd Day and Anthony Peeler. Doesn't seem like the rookies are coming in the same. They're not really paired together either. See, I think both shacks I got were paired with other, other players. Alfonso Ellis, Dave Johnson. Sean Rooks, Tom Gugliata. Let's see what we got left here. Okay, only about seven packs left. So, all right, can we can we do it in under twenty minutes? Only seven packs. Put up them fast. Matic Johnson for the tenth time. Tony Bennett, Shaquille O'Neal, Shaquille O'Neal. Man, this one looks pretty good too. I'm not seeing any immediate major flaws on any of these cards. So, all right, I think I will call this box a success so far, uh, depending on how these cards grade. If even one of those Shaq's gems, uh, I've like tripled my money on this box. Uh, already. If all three of them gem, which uh, I'm not really counting on that, but if I get lucky somehow and get back uh, three PSA 10s, that would just be a, you know, a killer box. Another Walt Williams. Yeah, so we got five of these draft pick cards and doubled up on the Walt Williams, but did not pull a shack, unfortunately. Alonzo morning number. There it is. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Uh, unfortunately, it's hard to tell if that's a ding or if that's just a color. Yeah, some whiting around the corner there. Okay. Might not be PSA worthy, but that's still a nice hit. Draft pick insert. Man, that would have been a monster hit when this first came out. So that probably won't go to grading, but awesome. That was definitely the one I was looking for, for sure. Hubert Davis, we got a bunch of these. It must be not that short printed. Oh my God, this leaning tower of base. Please don't fall over before I finish the video. Almost done. Last two packs here. Adam Keefe, Walt Williams. And last pack. Come on, one more shack. We already got four. We did better than I thought we were going to with three base shacks and the draft pick insert. So not too shabby at all. But let's see if we got some last pack mojo here. Hubert Davis, Doug Overton, and Anthony Avent. Okay, so no last pack mojo, giant stack of base, giant stack of rookies. Real quick recap over here. Put that Barkley back in the base stack. So I like this card a lot. This is one of my favorites. This Sean Kemp and Gary Payton, Thunder and Lightning. Really cool card. You could put a card like this in a set now and it wouldn't look that, that out of place, honestly. Uh, we got, so this was only Series 2 cards, so the Series 1 Jordan was not in the set, so this is the only Jordan we pulled. So we got 
Hubert Davis, two Walt Williams, Gugliata, Elmore Spencer, and Latrell Sprewell. Draft pick inserts. We got three Alonzo Mornings. These are just for my PC. I know these are like 50 cents a card, but it's good stuff to me. And then here's the mother load. Shaq, draft picks insert. Unfortunately, it's not in great condition since these are all on the back of the pack. There's really just one white little corner there. This might get a nine. I might send it and see if I can get a nine. And then we got three base Shaq rookies. So uh, I'm gonna inspect these once I stop the video. And uh, I will go ahead and sleeve those up, get them on over to PSA if they look good. Um, so thanks for watching guys. I'll be back with a lot more videos next week. I have a new subscription box coming called Sports Card Direct that I'm looking forward to as well as more Mosaic Mondays. Plus I'm gonna have a PSA reveal video coming soon. I have a huge P PSA submission uh, that just came, that just popped, so it's getting shipped to me now. I don't have it yet, but I will have it soon. So stay tuned for that. You do not wanna miss that one to see what uh, kind of grades we got. Um, so there's that and more all coming next week. And if you wanna see anything in the back here, let me know in the comments. The Stadium Club, I'm gonna hold off for a little bit, but anything else, uh, tops, Fleer, any of that kind of stuff, let me know, and we will do another Flashback Friday next week. So thanks for watching this video, and I'll see you guys on the next one.